Stanlop Asset Management Ltd warns that South Africa's central bank faces hurdles in maintaining a 4.5% inflation rate due to infrastructure issues and financial constraints. Chief Economist Kevin Links emphasizes the need to control rising costs of essential services to stabilize inflation. Despite inflation exceeding the target range for over three years, there are discussions about lowering the goal to 3% to align with international standards and potentially reduce interest rates. The country's inflation target is determined in collaboration between the finance minister and the central bank. Standard Bank Group Head of South Africa Macroeconomic Research, Dr. Alna Mulman, weighs in on the situation. The June CPI data is very encouraging insofar as it shows that headline inflation eased, core inflation eased and rental inflation remains quite subdued. Rental inflation is quite important not only because it is a large part of the inflation basket, but also because it is regarded as a barometer of demand pool inflation. In other words, this data set confirms a lack of demand-driven inflation, which is an important consideration when the Reserve Bank decides on the interest rate path. This data is therefore providing some support for our long-standing view that the Reserve Bank will likely start to ease monetary policy reasonably soon. This should provide relief to the economy rather than significant stimulus as we still don't expect a very deep cycle. We only expect one percentage point of interest rate cuts spread over four meetings, in other words, a quarter percentage point at a time.